Welcome back everyone to another episode of Shea TV. My name is Marissa Hill and shout out to my Adidas family for sending these my way. Today we'll be discussing an early look on some sneakers that we've probably seen a couple leaked pictures on, at least I have. These are the Adidas uh, Pharrell collaboration on the Human Race Samba. And this is in the white colorway. Let's take a quick sneak peek. to another unboxing and review if you're joining us for the first time welcome in to those of you who are already members thank you so much for joining and that is probably why you get to view this video early uh, if you are not yet a member be sure to check out that join button and become a shade community member so that you can have early access to watching my content for early release pairs of sneakers before anyone else gets to see it all right, so today we'll be covering a collaboration done with Pharrell and Human Race on the Samba Silhouette. You've probably seen me do many of these different colorway options. I've done it pretty much, I feel like every color of the rainbow, uh, but now we are getting into more neutral palettes and tones. So I was really excited uh, to see this in hand. We'll go through the overview of these, jump into size and fit, talk about how I styled this really just everyday looking sneaker, and then conclude with how much these will be retailed at. So let's jump right into it. As far as this silhouette goes, again, like I stated in all of my other unboxings on the For All Human Race collaboration on these, I feel like the quality is so high. They really knocked it out of the park with this one. The colors were beautiful as well. I feel like every single color where I've done so far has been just amazing. Uh, I will say though, a lot of people don't really feel as comfortable wearing bright pops of color. So I'm really glad that they're actually switching directions and going into some more neutral tones. Uh, there was a press release that leaked some images and talked about the different colors uh, that would be releasing in this series. So it was a white, a charcoal, and a terracotta. So again, some more just easier palettes to work with for those of you who are not too gung-ho about wearing bright pops of color, but I do think that this is really a great everyday sneaker. I feel like everyone needs to have just a clean white sneaker in their collection. I would say that the palette of this isn't perfectly white. It is kind of just a darker, deeper shade of a white tone, uh, but I do love the quality material used on this upper. Again, we do have these amazing just leather laces. We also get a secondary pair in this brown tone. So it is nice that you have an option to add a little bit more color if you're not feeling this monochromatic look. And then we've got this all leather tongue with the Adidas logo on top. So let's take a look at those details then move along to the side paneling.
wrapping around to the side panels. Again, just a very neutral, minimalistic tone that we've got going with the stripes and in between the same tone is that just beautiful leather in the light white uh, color scheme. And then as we work our way to the back of the heel, same material. Uh, and we've got the subtle branding of human race here in just a more cream tone. So it's very subtle. You can't really see it so much, which is nice. It's very complimentary of that leather underneath. And then the interior again is a leather insole. So you're really getting high quality materials used on the interior all over. So you're getting leather as well on the collar. Uh, but yeah, pretty much the entire, the sneaker is all leather. Uh, and then we've got Samba in white. Then as we work our way to the midsole and outsole, it's in this translucent tone of a nice, just light creamy color scheme, which works its way onto the outsole. All right. And then we also get two duster bags. So we've got one side that says human race, one side that says Adidas. So again, just making it more of a luxurious feeling sneaker with these dusters that they include within the packaging of this. So let's take a look at all those details, then move into sizing. So as far as sizing goes, again, the Samba silhouette is very narrow, but as you can kind of see with trends and the way people are transitioning with their style of sneakers, Adidas has really been pushing a lot of their more narrow sized uh, silhouettes and the Samba being one of those. So I would say at least stick true to size if you have narrow feet, but if you have flatter, wider feet, you might actually want to go up in size range just because these do run very narrow. All right, so now let's jump into how I style this really easy to style color scheme. For the first look, I decided to wear a beige tank with just some nice wide legged cream pants. Again, I just think that neutral tones will work great with this, but you can also wear some nice pops of color if you wanna go outside the box and not stay so minimalistic. Then for the second look, I wore a white skirt and that was in a denim material with a beige tank bodysuit. And for the last and final look, I decided to go with a monochromatic feel with a satin kind of nice goldeny sheen toned uh, beige uh, set that had a matching set of pants and a zip up jacket.
Okay, I'm so high that you take my breath away. Get a little closer every step I take my breath. All right, so as far as retail goes, these are set to retail at $200. Right now, there is no scheduled release date, so stay tuned until we get more information on the exact day that you can expect to snag a pair of these. All right, that's it for this unboxing and review. If you joined us for the first time, thank you so much. My name is Marissa Hill. This is Shade TV. We'll catch you all next episode. Take it all from me till it ain't nothing left, okay? I got a brand new feeling. Take me up, need a brand new ceiling. Said you can't do, but man, you